It's weird that a lot of people are debating whether they should come to church today. He is the reason. Hallelujah. Well, while you guys are all standing, I'm going to ask you to please open up your Bible to the Bible. Abran sus Biblias. Matthew. En el libro de Mateo, chapter 2, capítulo 2, verses 1 and 2, del versículo 1 y 2. When you have it, you can say amen. Cuando lo tengan, digan amen. Mateo, capítulo 2, versículos 1 y 2. I've titled this message, What is your reaction to the birth of Jesus? El título de este mensaje es, ¿Cuál es tu reacción a la, al nacimiento de Jesucristo? Amen. 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 The word is read in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Verse 1. Now after Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea, in the days of Herod the king, behold, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem. Verse 2. Saying, where is he who has been born king of the Jews? For we have seen his star in the east and have come to worship him. La palabra del Señor, Señor, en el nombre del Padre, del Hijo y del Espíritu Santo. Versículo 1. Cuando Jesús nació en Belén de Judea, en días del rey Herodes, vinieron del oriente a Jerusalén unos magos, diciendo, ¿Dónde está el rey de los judíos que ha nacido? Porque su estrella hemos visto en el oriente y venimos a adorarle. Amen. Amen. Father God, we thank you, Lord, for everybody that is here. We thank you for the privilege that you allow us to be in your house. Father God, look at this word that you have given me. I ask that it be you speaking through me, God. That you minister to each and every person that is here. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You may be seated. So the Bible says so la Biblia dice that when que cuando the wise men los magos came asking where is the king of the Jews vinieron preguntando dónde está el rey de los judíos because they saw the star porque vieron la estrella the Bible says la Biblia dice in verse 3 en el verso 3 that when Herod heard this que cuando Herodes escuchó esto he was troubled se turbó and not only was he troubled y no solamente se turbó él but everyone in Jerusalem pero todos también en Jerusalén now this is very interesting esto es muy interesante Considering the fact that they were waiting for the Messiah. Considerando el hecho de que ellos estaban esperando por el Mesías. Now at the time, en ese tiempo, the Bible says la Biblia dice, that Jesus was supposed to be born in Bethlehem. Dice que Jesús estaba para nacer en Belén. But he was not there. Pero él no estaba allí. Him and Mary, David and Mary, David y María, were in Nazareth. Estaban en Nazaret. But since the word said, pero como la Biblia dice, that he needed to be born in Bethlehem, que él tenía que nacer en Belén. God allowed, Dios permitió, Augustus Caesar, o a Augusto César, to make a decree, que hiciera un decreto, that he wanted to make everybody do a census. Que para que todo mundo se fuera a censar. Yes, so everybody had to return to where they were from originally. So ellos todos tenían que volver a su sitio donde nacieron. And David, y David, sorry, Joseph, José, was from y era de Bethlehem, de Belén. So they had to return so ellos tenían que volver in order to complete the census. Para completar el censo. But in reality, But in realidad, it was God in a cure you see God never goes against his word what God says is going to happen in your life is going to happen in your life the promises that God has for you in his word they are going to come to pass so we can always trust in God's word now as they were going back ellos iban atrás to do the census, para ser censados the Bible says that while they were there, la Biblia dice que mientras estaban allí the days el día of her giving birth approached, de, su, de dar a luz llegó but they were already there. pero ya estaban allí so it's not like the movies, no es como las películas where the movies show Mary, donde enseñan a María que estaba en un camello y estaban corriendo and they were knocking on doors y nadie quería abrirla. That's not what happened. 
no es lo que pasó. The Bible says that they didn't find an inn, that there was no place available for them in the inn. La Biblia dice que no había un lugar para ellos en el, en el hotel. And we think it's a hotel, but they said the inn. Lo que sería un hotel o un sitio de alojo. Right, but in reality, Pero en realidad, the word inn, la palabra inn, in Greek, en el griego, it means a guest room. Se, significaba un lugar de reunión. Yes, so in other words, so en otras palabras, there was no place in the guest room, no había ningún lugar en el sitio de, 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 hospedaje, de hospedaje, because everybody was there getting completing the census porque todo el mundo ya estaba allí completando su censo and according to tradition y de acuerdo a la tradición according to Middle Eastern experts y a los expertos del, me del Medio Oeste yes, according to them de acuerdo a ellos the animals and the people used to live in the same place los animales y la gente vivían en el mismo lugar so the people por lo tanto la gente they used to live in the upper level que miraban, vivían en el lugar más alto and in the back y de atrás Symbolizaban el intento. 
de Dios to reveal himself both to Gentiles and to the Jews. Y revelarse a los dos, a los judíos y a los gentiles. Now being a pastor, el ser un pastor, it wasn't a, a, a high position. No era una posición muy alta. It was a very low position. Era una posición baja. And these shepherds, mm. estos pastores, were taking care of the animals that were going to be sacrificed. They were going to be sacrificed. Iban a ser sacrificados. Now, what is possible? 
lo que es posible that they probably heard of Daniel's prophecy regarding the Messiah que quizás escucharon la profecía de Daniel en referencia al Mesías or oh, that they heard about what Balaam spoke about the star of Jacob que quizás escucharon cuando Balaam escuchó hablado de la estrella de Jesús or God just revealed himself to them o simplemente Dios se les reveló a ellos these things don't matter estas cosas no importan the point is la cuestión es that these men que estos hombres traveled viajaron from a far land de una tierra lejana to worship Jesus after the Messiah Another person that was disturbed. 
disturbed que era también, eh, turbada by the, the news of Jesus' birth de esta noticia del nacimiento de Jesús was King Herod. Era el rey Herodes. King Herod was disturbed el rey Herodes estaba turbado because he was king. Porque él era el rey. And he believed. Y él creía Um, he believed y él creía that Jesus wanted to usurp him. Que Jesús lo que quería era usurparlo. Herod was a person Herodes era una persona that was ruthless. Que no tenía reglas. Ruthless, like he was just evil. Él era malvado. He killed his own family. Él mató su propia familia. His mother-in-law. Él mató a su suegra. Brothers-in-law. Sus uh, cuñados. Anybody that was competition. Lo quien sea que él consideraba una competencia. Interestingly enough, y, 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 interesantemente, he thought él pensaba that Jesus wanted to take his place. Que Jesús quería coger su lugar because he porque él was a usurper. Era un usurpador. That wasn't his rightful place. Ese no era su lugar, correcto. He was not of the lineage of Jacob. Él no era del linaje de Jacob. He was a descendant of Esau. Él era de descendiente de Esaú. He was placed there by the Romans. Él no fue puesto ahí por los romanos. And so you see, por lo tanto vemos that a lot of times the way that you think about others, de la misma que de la manera que pensamos de otros, is often reflection of how you are yourself. Es regularmente una reflexión de quién nosotros somos nosotros mismos. And so what he did, por lo tanto lo que él hizo, he tried to win the people's support, es que intentó de ganar este favor de la gente by fixing the temple, de, en arreglando el templo. And like Herod, y como Herodes, there are many people today, hay gente hoy día, that think that Jesus, que piensan que Jesús, is coming to destroy their life, viene para destruir sus vidas. They think that Jesus, piensan que Jesús, is coming to deprive them, viene para quitarles of their privileges, de sus privilegios. They think that they're in joy, y que ellos piensan que están disfrutando. They think that they have peace, y que ellos piensan que tienen paz. But Jesus has come to give you a peace. Pero Jesús ha venido para darte una paz. Unlike anything that the world can offer. No es como la nada que el mundo pueda dar. He says, my peace is not like the peace that the world gives. Mi paz, se dice, no es como el mundo la da. My happiness that I offer you. Mi felicidad que yo te ofrezco. It's not dependent on you being high. No depende de tu estar bien alto. It's not dependent on you being drunk. No, no depende de tu estar borracho. I came to give you true joy.
con esto termino que había un hombre llamado Simeón y este hombre decía que él era justo que era devoto no tenía un título But it says that he was waiting for the consolation of Israel. Pero él decía que él estaba esperando por la consolación de Israel. And the Holy Spirit was upon him. Y la Biblia dice que el Espíritu de Dios estaba sobre él. The Holy Spirit was upon him. El Espíritu Santo estaba sobre él. And it says that it had been revealed to him. Y dice que fue revelado a él. That he would not see death. Que él no vería la muerte. Until he had seen the Lord Christ. Hasta que viera a Jesús. And the Bible says that when she, when when uh, mm. when Mary and Joseph, y la Biblia dice que cuando María y José were presenting Jesus in the temple, presentaban a Jesús en el templo. The Bible says that he came by the Spirit into the temple. Dice que por el Espíritu él vino al templo. And that when he saw Jesus, y que cuando él vio a Jesús, he said, Lord, he dijo Dios. He said, Now, ahora, he said, you can let me depart in peace. Te puedes dejar morir en paz. He said, my eyes have seen. Los sabios dejaron todo para venir y adorarle. The Jews were troubled by him. Los 